in your first questions, your first question is, was your first contemplation uh, was what is the definition of death? Mm -hmm. And you talked about uh, death being change and mm -hmm. that, that constant uh, movement from moment to moment. Mm -hmm. And the second contemplation was uh, what happens when you die? Mm -hmm. I'm not sure I caught the distinction between the definition and what happens. Distinction between the two? <clears throat> From the Buddhist tradition. Oh, what happens when you die? That's a long topic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's going to be my whole book. But um, basically, you know, there are two factors, you know, one is we have idea about what is death, right? We have general ideas about what is death, and then we have a lot of projections about what's going to happen at that point, you know, pain, suffering, fear, what not, you know. Now, from Buddhist point of view, it is simply what happens at the time of death, it is, it is simply a new and fresh experience which is the which is giving us tremendous opportunity to explore further the deeper nature of reality you know which from Buddhist point of view the deeper nature of reality or in other traditions maybe deeper and uh, higher nature of reality and so therefore, you know, death is not really negative. You know, what happens at the time of death is not negative from Buddha's point of view. It's not really like a pain or a fear, but actually it is uh, what I call new adventure. You know, it's like new adventure. It's actually like, um, what do you call those? Um, Rides, like different kinds of roller coasters and different rides in the theme park, you know. You have lots of fear and projections when you are in the lineup, <laughs> right? And some people just freak out in the lineup, <laughs> totally, you know. Um, they have to leave. But when you're really riding any roller coaster or what have you, it's different from what you thought it would be. Right? Our projections are different from what, what the reality is. So death is like that for most of us, that we have so many projections and ideas uh, because we are right now in the lineup for this roller coaster ride. But when it's really there, it's different. So rather than projecting too much, but if we keep our mind open, right, open, free to this new adventure, to this new ride, you know, then death can bring, or dying process can bring a lot of positive qualities out from our basic nature. And so therefore, from Buddha's perspective, you know, what happens at the time of death you know, then we go through different stages. You know, there's like a moment of death, and then the uh, and then the following, following moments. You know, uh, we talk about forty-nine day process. Yeah. So there are a lot of actually materials available in English. You can you know look at.